Now let's go back to that report from NBC 26's Valerie Juarez in Kashina tonight on an issue on the ballot in Menominee County. It's been a very busy day at this polling location in Kashina, where many people have been lining up to cast their ballots. And on that ballot is a $35 million referendum that could fund the construction of a new high school. Please keep your ID out. Take a pen so that you can fill out your ballot form. It was a busy afternoon at the Menominee County Sheriff's Office where voting for this year's spring election took place. I don't have you listed here. Mike Hall and Sabrina Molina were one of the several dozens of people who came out to vote for the Menominee Indian School District referendum to fund a new high school. I think it's a great idea. Um, we have seven kids between both of us. The referendum cost $35 million. And with those dollars, the district would not only build a new high school, but it also plans to convert the existing high school to a middle school and make improvements to Kashina Primary School. As enrollment is increasing, our building space is shrinking, particularly at the elementary school. So as we, as we started looking at potential renovations and looking at the amount, we thought, well, maybe it might be easier just to build a new school, go through a referendum versus having all these renovations at three different schools. Essentially, it would be one educational campus with all three schools. Mike and Sabrina say they felt it was their duty to cast their ballot, as it's possibly one step closer to providing their children a better educational future. It be a really great um, experience and stuff, having new classrooms, um, more room for, you know, extracurricular activities. To have a place where kids can want to go and be excited to learn, that's what I'm, I'm for. According to the district, sharing staff and resources could reduce transportation costs enhance security, and improve access to health services and special education services. NBC 26 didn't find anyone who was opposed to the referendum. Thank you for coming in. In Kashina, Valerie Juarez, NBC 26.